Stop calling me that! You've wasted much precious time already. No more choices, Ray McCoy. Meet us at the moon bus. Together we will face the tigers that wait in the night's forest. Okay. Let's go this way. So first things first, I'm gonna head back home. Why does everybody call me and stuff when I'm trying to do these recordings? It never fails. It never fails. Let's go through here. What's over here? Oh God, you see that? There's another rat. Or R-O-U-S's. Oh, that's how he longs. Okay, I don't need to go there. Ooh, hey, knock it off now. Ah! He's so scary! I'm watching you. These things are freaking huge, man. Who the hell? Who in the world? Oh, hey now, hey now. gone. I don't know who the hell that was. Creepy. Who is this guy? I'm watching you. What is he doing? Maybe that's... Okay. I'm just not gonna bother with him. He's obviously crazy. So let's head back to our house. Maybe I can get some rest for once. Poor oh, McCoy's had a rough three days. Tough day, McCoy. You could say that. Yeah. Steel is looking for you. And Bryant. You've been keeping the whole department hopping. You and Guza. I know. You looking for me too, Gaff? Looking. Not killing. I'm in a good mood today. <laughs> you know you got some interesting dead. neighbors, McCoy. Yeah, well, I've been too busy to visit lately. You gonna turn yourself in? I'm thinking about it. Think hard. You killed anyone yet? Guza. It's like I said before. You retire a human, your career is over. Your life, too, maybe. Well, then I won't tell you about Guza. I mean, uh... We don't live forever. Hey, whoa. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> so I say, well, you should have voted for him, then. <laughs> There's Very the man good. himself. Very funny, yes. Governor, let's get down to business. At last estimate, five billion tons of kipple surround this city. Eventually, it's going to have to be cleared away. Elgin, we've got specials to do that job. But the attrition rate is enormous. No, no. There's only one way it can be accomplished. My way. Unfortunately, your way is illegal. For the moment, yes. But laws can be changed. And if replicants were allowed to work on Earth, imagine what your legacy would be. Governor Maurice Colvig, the national hero who eliminated toxic debris. <laughs> Even your opponents will vote for you. How can you possibly guarantee that no tragedies will occur? It's a very simple solution to an old design challenge. Give them jobs on Earth, and they will never desire a different life. That is a lie. Who's there? <laughs> it's one of my children, I think, and a very resourceful one at that. Why don't you show yourself? <laughs> With pleasure. I do love how cocky he is. Who is this man? I'd like to ask the same question. One more word from him, and he'll be dead. I will not be spoken to! <laughs> yes! You're certainly a man of your word. I want all the data you have on replicant DNA structures, the mutation studies, everything. Clovis. Why don't you just take a seat? Is a we'll badass. Have I don't have time to talk. I wish I could help you, I really do. But the data is useless. The four year lifespan is unalterable. 
my friends, my family, dying before my very eyes. And all you can say is, there is no hope. Yeah. Time is precious, my son. And you have been keeping yours well. And when night comes, I'll go to place fit for woe. Walking along the darkened valley with silent melancholy. Run, Clovis, run! I would prefer him alive if possible. Dude, look at the dude on the left. Look at that mullet. Yeah. <laughs> he just threw a body at him. <laughs> Not exactly the conclusion I had in mind. Have you stationed guards in the mezzanine? Yes, sir, but I mean, after that fall. Oh, don't be a fool. He's not dead yet. His time hasn't come. Oh, man, Anna Pornstash? That oh, dude is. Oh, God. No. Oh, no. She'd been shot once in the head. At least she died fast. Oh, poor Maggie. He's calling me. Pick up. I see you survived. No thanks to you. Don't you think you'd already be dead if that's what I so desired? Talking like a god, Clovis. Isn't that a little over the top, even for you? Prometheus was chained to a rock and vultures pecked at his liver. I haven't quite had to suffer such ordeals, literally speaking, of course. Well, there's still time. <laughs> I'm calling to apologize, brother. I should have never recruited Guza against you. I just had to make sure that you weren't going to betray us. You're just a dick. Guza probably you. thought that he recruited you. To be honest, we had a sort of a business relationship where our different interests converged, but he was never to be trusted. Not like you. I appreciate that. Is something the matter, brother? My dog's My dead. dog's been murdered. Yeah. And does that not whet your thirst for vengeance? Come back home to us. We'll demand justice and receive it. How do I know who I really am? Guza must have programmed you as an experiment to see if you can really act as one of them. He wiped out all your memories of our time together. As soldiers during the Phobos Wars, the Battle of the Gemini, firefights on the top of Olympus Mons. I don't remember. But if you dig real deep and feel, you'll know what's real. It's a passage to freedom, McCoy. To your destiny. An underground railroad to carry you from bondage. We'll be waiting. All right. Violent street crime in the city rose again last year by a whopping 26%, according to reflect on our life. The beautiful music of Blade Runner. All right, let's save. Portrait of the sleep deprived. Yeah, no joke. No messages. Hmm. I'm in demand. Now, I think... There's two endings I know how to get to, and I'm not entirely sure if I can get to both of them from where I am right now. Oh, it makes me sad. Oh. It wasn't any mystery, and if I'd gotten home a few minutes earlier, it would have been me down there on the killing floor. No, it was a message, plain and simple. Crystal was giving me one last chance what to disappear, but bitch. now I had a little message of my own to deliver. Yeah, I'm gonna fuck her up. Straight up. Okay. Kill my dog. She'd been shot once in the head. At least she died fast. Crystal, you. <laughs> Evil raging Your floor sea. number, please. Uh, we gotta go back to the sewers. Man, that's messed up. Down this way. Yeah, there's two endings I know how to get to for sure. I'm not entirely sure which one I'm gonna get, though, to be honest. I know the one I want, and I'm gonna attempt to get that one. 
see if we can do it. Uses, they're everywhere. A little faster. Ooh. Okay, so yeah, we can head up. Don't walk in the fire, you'll burn. Idiot. Let me save it again. I can't believe she would kill a dog. Talk about heartless, man. Run faster. We've got a person to kill. The tunnel stretched for miles. I was sure it came out somewhere, but I didn't have time to find out. Well, oh, wait a minute. Okay, hold up, hold up. Maybe it's this way. Ah, cooling, refreshing sewer water. Yeah, here we are. Okay, so we're under... The car shop. Got anything to say? I hope you got paperwork for all these vehicles. <laughs> are we kids or what, Ray? All right, I take all right. that as a you can take it. Still business, Ray. Jeez. Hmm. Now I'm confused. Could have sworn. I am obviously very, very lost here. Okay. Hmm. Come on. I could have sworn that you run into crystal steel somewhere around here. Okay, let me end the episode. I'm going to do some poking around and figure out where I need to go next. Because I am at a massive loss of where to go. So, I will see you guys next time. Hopefully, I will be able to figure out how to get the ending I want. That's my goal. So, until then, you guys be excellent to each other.